going on YouTube family? Listen, I know that many of you are probably a part of a number of different forest groups or communities online, right? And you're probably on YouTube subscribed to dozens of YouTube channels. My question is this, are you still losing in the forest market? And have you tried the Soda Music Forest University? If you haven't, come on, follow me. So you never want to be faced with losing a trade again, right? Be sure to watch this entire video because I'm going to reveal some things to you that will possibly change the way you look at the forex market forever. All right, so as most of you should know, my name is Yusuf Scott. I'm the guy behind the Soda Easy Forex University, also better known as the Forex Go Online. In fact, if you're still looking for forex training, be sure to go visit www.sodaneasyforex.com. And also, if you're wondering why they can send me the Forest Goat, go check out theforestgoat.com. Now, just as I tell you guys in all of my videos, I'm very grateful and thankful to have you guys here watching yet another video of mine. If you're watching this video and you have not yet subscribed to this channel, click on that subscribe button at the bottom. And make sure you also follow us on social media because we're on Facebook and Instagram as well. So again, you still want to increase your chances of never having to lose again in the market. You want to be sure that you're always in position to win. I want to share something with you guys that will hopefully change the way you look at trading Forex and how you see the market. Now, if you guys notice my shelving unit behind me, it's four, four levels deep or four levels high. I look at this shelving unit as levels, just like looking at the Forex market. It, all it is, it's, it's levels. We have levels here, four levels. That's it. There's nothing complicated about that. Now, when you start throwing in all these extra things, oh, look at this and look at that, it makes it complicated when really all you see is there are four levels. That's it. If you're looking at it, counting it going up, you have four, or you count it going down, you still have four. That simple. You have four levels, okay? That's it. And that's all trading forex is about. Market structure, okay? Remember this, a market, can only grow or rise from a solid foundation. Just like in real estate, a structure is only built from a solid foundation. That's it. So if you see this, you have four different levels. Depending on where the market is, will determine where it's headed. If you have a market going down, it's going towards support. If it breaks through there, it's still going down, it's going towards the next level of support. But as soon as the market starts going back up, it's going back towards resistance. So the question is, where do you get in? Well, that's where the perfect entry strategy comes in. It will show you where to get in. Now, unfortunately, as a Forex trader, you guys know there are multiple time charts. You have the one minute, the five minute, the 15 minute, 30 minute, one hour, uh, four hour, even a 12 hour, weekly and monthly. You have all of those. But let me tell you one truth about all of those because if you look at each time chart, even if you have indicators on each time chart, they're gonna all look different. I guarantee you, they're gonna all look different. But there is one common trait amongst them all. Can you guess what it is? I'm waiting. Let me tell you, these four levels. When you find the best levels in the market, the market, regardless of what time frame you're on, they're gonna move, they're gonna ebb and flow. They're gonna do whatever they wanna do away from those levels or towards those levels, okay? So let's, let's think about it. If you were on the one hour chart and you found, as I tell my students 
a big daddy level. And this is the big daddy level. That market is at the big daddy level. If the market is supposed to go down, because this, this structure is so well positioned, when they constructed this level or this foundation, they put that thing in where even a category five storm wouldn't be able to tear that structure down. Wouldn't be able to topple over that building. When they, when they put this level on, it was strong. The market ran up to that level and guess what? The market could not penetrate. It was impenetrable. It couldn't penetrate the level. So you know it's gonna go back down. Now I will guarantee you one thing. Regardless of the time frame you're looking at, when that market starts to go down, it's going down, okay? It's going down. When, when, when a market is at a level, a big daddy level, and it's moving down with such momentum, all of the time frames are gonna move down. Now I will tell you one thing, the smaller time frames are gonna react to their level much faster. And the larger time frames are gonna be a lot slower to react to the level. But depending on where the market is during the ebb and flow would determine, because sometimes it may appear that the larger are reacting sooner or quicker, but it'll always be the smaller that's reacting really faster than all the other pairs, which is why you may have a market um, acting crazy on the one minute, but you go to the monthly, you get nothing. It's just standing still. It's like, what is it doing? It's doing nothing. So if you can remember this, if your focus is only to find the best levels, you will stand a better chance at winning in the Forex market. And that's what I help my students realize. Finding those best levels in the market and knowing how to react. Notice I said react. Not act, but react. Because you see, they, I'm not gonna say no names, but they are the ones pushing the market. They're pushing the market. So you have to let them act and then you react to their action. Now, I'm, I'm gonna leave something with you guys real quick. And I normally tell my students this. What I believe is this. In the Forex market, those who push the market around, this is what I believe they do. Okay, five minute chart. Okay, 15 minute chart. Uh, 30 minute chart. Uh, one minute chart, one hour, four hour, 12 hour, um, you know, monthly. This is what I want you guys to do. Um, today is, of course, December 1st of 2020. I want to tell you guys this. I'm going to let you guys move about your way, do whatever you want to do, find your own ebb and flow. But this is what I need for you all to do. I need for you all to, on December 31st, I need for all of you to be at the COVID level that happened earlier this year. I don't care what it is that you do, make sure that you're back at that level. Now, I believe that that reenactment is true because there are so many times that I've been in the market and I've seen all of one family of pairs at a certain level reacting the same way. I mean, all year long, they're doing their thing, moving about, doing all kind of crazy stuff, but then they all somehow, some way, some fashion, wind up at the one common level. So that lets you know one thing. If they're all doing that and finding home at that one level, there's someone who's controlling what's going on. And ladies and gentlemen, don't be confused by the Forex illusion, all right? It's all an illusion. It's all about market structure. Think about it. Everything has a beginning just as everything has an ending. Think about it today. This is no crazy uh, way of looking at it. It's logic and it's right before us all. It's the air that we breathe. Everything is based on an entry and an exit. Beginning, you know, ending. Open, close, up, down all based on that. And when you can master this, if you see the market is moving up, it can only be going up to a level of resistance. And if you see that the market is going down, regardless of which phase it's in, it's only going down to a level of support. 
and only moving up to a level of resistance. Master market structure. Better yet, if you're having trouble with mastering market structure, allow me to help you master it as I've been helping thousands of students from all across the world over the last five, six years. Do it today. As I tell you guys all the time, very grateful and thankful to have you guys here and have nothing short of a fantastic day. Remember, stay healthy, stay safe, and stay prayed up during these times. All right? Peace, everybody.